He is rockabilly. Mean, surly, nasty, brutal. In that movie, he couldn't give a fuck about nothing. He's a rock and roll, living fast, dying young, and a good-looking corpse, you know? I watched that hillbilly, and I want to be him so bad. Now just look good. City, Detroit, to find my true love. If you gave me a million years to ponder, I would never have guessed that true romance in Detroit would ever go together. And to this day, the events that followed all seem like a distant dream. But the dream was real and was to change our lives forever. I kept asking Clarence why our world seemed to be collapsing and everything seemed so shitty. And he'd say, that's the way it goes. But don't forget, it goes the other way too. That's the way romance is. Usually that's the way it goes. But every once in a while, it goes the other way too. Hey boss, get ready to be happy. Everybody, it's 622 here in LA. I'm David Perry at KBLU. Where are you from? What's your favorite color? What's your favorite movie star? What kind of uh, music do you like? What do you turn on? What's your turn offs? So the uh, big question is do you have a, do you have a fella? <laughs> okay, I can get one by one.
on me. I'm in charge. Okay. The part you'll be reading for is one of the bad guys. There's Brian and Marty. Who? Is there a problem? No. Look, I uh, <clears throat> have one of those Chesterfields now. Sure. You got a match? Oh, wait, no, no, I got, don't bother. I got one. You're Sicilian, huh? What are your uh, what are your turn ons? Mm, thank you, Rock. And I can appreciate the fine things in life like sugar. Tell us his voice. Kung Fu, pot. Turn ons. <laughs> turn offs. Mm -hmm. Persian. <laughs> Do you uh, have a fella? Ask me that one a little bit later.